Good morning, Chief Dave here. It's Monday, 30th of January. Uh, just where that green taxi is coming out over the road, that's where my hotel is. Uh, like I say, I'm in uh, Na Treng. Uh, just going down the beach. Looks like there's some big waves out there today. We'll take a look. Sand, nice, very fine sand. A little bit of litter swept up on the beach, but not too much. See the beach goes way down there. In the distance over there, you've got the cable car going across to the island. I don't know what the island is, as you can see as well, some fairly decent waves coming in, the bay goes right round, quite a long way, so I think there's quite a lot to see here, I've been here for a week so uh, should be interested. There's a lady selling either langoustine or small lobster, not sure. And then all the way along the front, got a lot of very large hotels. Yeah, quite happy here. I'm just gonna go dip my feet in the water now. Check out and see if it's as cold as it was down the coast a little way. Lots of little holes in the sun where uh, either crabs or worms, I don't know what they are. Here we go. Oh, a little bit chilly. <laughs> Some mad falls over there, going for a dip. Crazy people. Not my idea of fun. A little bit breezy. Keep this cool. Yeah. So fairly pleased being around here. I'm just going to chill out, relax, and get my feet wet. Taking a little walk along the seafront. As you can see, the sign says no swimming. I don't think I'd like to swim in that. Just coming down the promenade. Lovely little beach bar here. Nice manicured seating area back here. That's some of the prices for the beach there. doing fruit it's 
nice place to be, nice beach, but uh, I think fairly unsafe for swimming. Let's have a look at the beach safety rules. Do not swim in areas with a red flag. No topless females. Uh, raise arms when needed help. Under 60s must be accompanied. Go look after your own stuff. Don't swim after food or drink. Follow instructions of lifeguard. Uh, in case of rip curl current, swim diagonally across it. If you have a flotation device, don't uh, let it go. Uh, people swim at their own risk. And if there's a thunderstorm, leave the beach. So, that's uh, all your advice. Another nice beach barrier. Sailing club. Really nice place to walk. Uh, besides the bikes to be there, yeah. Uh, it just seems to go on and on. Okay, so you're coming to this shopping mall. You buy a Lux A20 or that thing there, the F8. You get a Whatever point that is, we're getting on seven million, seventy million baht, uh, seventy million dong. However much that is. Anyway, we'll take a wander around here, see what's here. Little shoe shop at the bottom. food shop area very nicely decorated we're going to go and check out foods don't need to stock up alright so I've just done a little shop here, got a few little bits and bobs. Uh, still getting over this cold. Starting to feel a bit dodgy at the moment, so uh, going to make my way back to the hotel. I'm going to rest for a few hours, even though I haven't done an awful lot already.
So, we're back at the exit. Take a walk down to my hotel on the road, see what's down here. And then, uh, go put my feet up for a few hours. Quite a nice day today. Notice this is uh, quite a nice coffee shop on the corner here. I notice the cups of the coffee, they're very large. So I reckon I might be coming here for a couple later. As it is, I'm feeling all weak again. Again, chill out. But down here, my hotel is not as far as the next junction. There's nothing really to show you along here. So I reckon that'll be the end of this vlog. I might just show you a little walk up to my hotel. Further than that, nothing to see. Old hotel here. Looks closed. There's cockerels. More cockerels and hens. And stray dogs. I thought that stray dog over there was a part of the statue, but uh, it's just taking a drink out of the fountain. Anyway, onwards and onwards. I just noticed that place there, lovely little coffee shop. Look, look. Look, look, tea and coffee. There you go. But it's not fuck short, it's fuck long. So I was getting a bit thirsty, so I thought I'd come into a place I seen this morning and uh, grab a iced chocolate. So I ordered it, didn't realise I was in a Starbucks. First time I've ever been in a Starbucks. It's a bit like going into Hooters. Prices are extortionate. Uh, 85,000 dong for a chocolate, medium size. And uh, that comes to about three quid. So there's my first Starbucks. So, well done Dave. So, not cheap again anymore. Okay, so I've just come out in the evening. Got a splitting headache. Run out of paracetamol. So I'm going to go to the shops, get that, get a few drinks, maybe something to eat. Seems tons of these three wheel bikes about go touring around the town, all got uh, all well lit up, Rob just going for a quick shot, tons of events, but not tons, lots of them. Yeah, we'll go over to the supermarket. Get some paracetamol. Get some water. And uh, maybe get something to eat. That I can eat in my hotel room because I don't feel like uh, eating out yet. And then that'll be my night. So we'll have a look. 
We've got these drivers going round. Thank you for punters. Hello, Master. Thank you, mate. No. Okay, so it's only about eight o'clock in the evening. <coughs> the only reason I went out was to get some paracetamol because uh, Ed was banging. So I got that, I got a load of water, some crisps, just a few little bits and bobs. And I'm back to my hotel, it's only eight o'clock, like I say, but. Uh, Still not feeling good, so we're uh, just going to chill out and laze around. So that'll be it from this video. So, good night. Please like, subscribe, and press the bell. Thanks for watching.